What are some places on Earth that are still unexplored because locals fear them? And what are they afraid of? When I was teaching in Saudi Arabia, locals refused to take me to Mada in Saleh, it's very similar to Petra in Jordan. Built by the same people. Unfortunately it is known to be cursed by jinn. Muslims won't go there. Really annoying BC my Arabic wasn't near good enough to get me there alone. Not really unexplored, but in Japan there are many keyhole-shaped burial mounds. Many date back to the 3rd century, but with few exceptions the government won't allow excavation. The Catacombs under Paris. There are about 150 miles of maze-like tunnels under the city. Only a small portion gets toured by the public. People have ventured deep into them and would go missing for days. Oh I remember AR slash WTF thread ages ago where someone took photos of a trip they made in the catacombs. It was super creepy and I'm certain they said that they encountered some subterranean people within. Then there was something about catacomb parties or raves. It's not unexplored per SE, but the plutonium at Hierapolis emits toxic gas intense enough to kill most living things in moments, and was assumed to be a gate to the underworld. In a rather illuminating display of their culture, rather than avoiding the cave of painfully slow asphyxiation, the Romans turned it into a tourist attraction at which one could purchase a live animal to throw in or meet oracles of Pluto, who had been through into the cave and lived. Most of the world's blue holes are unexplored because they are fucking dangerous. They are deep underwater sinkholes, hundreds of feet deep one is over 900 feet deep that generally have a toxic layer acid part of the way down. Recently, an ancient city was discovered in the vicinity slash in the forest area in Rio Platano, Honduras. Recently, because the cartels have such a big fucking hold over it, that it's simply impossible to go in there without dying or worse. So much history that could await along that river, not found because of drug lords. La Ciudad Blanca I believe it was called. The bottom of the Cave of the Crystals in Mexico. The cave is naturally so hot and filled with water most of the time, it can't be fully explored. But the pictures are gorgeous from when people did go in. Hades Gate or the Gate to Hell in Denizli, Turkey. Supposedly, there's so much carbon dioxide coming out of the entrance of the ancient site that anything that gets close to it dies from asphyxiation. Scientists have determined because this cave sits along a fault line, that the carbon dioxide filled it from an opening in the Earth's crust. Perhaps my favorite, and that is closest to me is the former nuclear jet testing labs in the Dawsonville Forest in Georgia. They are abandoned now. Some people have explored there, but back in the 50s, there was naked nuclear testing, no protection barrier, which means there is concern for high levels of residual radiation. That said, the bunkers still exist, rumored to be complete with furniture and other things untouched since it was abandoned. There's an area in Tibet called the Tsangpa Gorge that allegedly has a massive hidden waterfall that only appears to people who have reached Nirvana. Last I checked, the Chinese don't allow people to explore the area much, but that may have changed by now. There's a book about it written by a guy named Ian Baker who did two expeditions into the gorge. Bottomless lakes in New Mexico are what they sound like. Some of the small lakes have no bottom and feed underground rivers and streams stretching hundreds possibly thousands of miles. Trackers have been tossed in and found days later in the Gulf of Mexico. They have claimed many lives of careless swimmers and the dangerous lakes are now sealed off. I swam in the safe ones nearby but always felt kinda creeped out. Yup had a friend swimming on the lake near Angelfire NM and locals came out screaming to get him to come out do the lake having dangerous holes. This sounds like it. Hauska Castle was built to cover up the opening to hell a seemingly bottomless pit from which the demons of hell would crawl out at night to wreak havoc. Located in the Czech countryside. Before the castle was built to seal this entrance to hell prisoners who had been condemned to death were thrown in. Scary shit my dudes. The Anyanga Mountains in Zimbabwe. The myth is that if you climb this mountain, 
and make nasty slash derogatory comments about the vegetation or rocks or anything you see there, e.g. you pick a fruit and comment on how bitter it tastes, you'll disappear forever. It sounds ridiculous until you learn that several people, including tourists, have disappeared in that mountain. Extensive manhunts and helicopter searches failed to find a single person, dead or alive. Locals fear the mountain, but tourists take it as a challenge, but doesn't end up good for a lot of them. The most recent case was Zaid Dada. Kolat Sayakal in Siberia. The name means dead mountain in Mansi, the language of the local tribe there. It's also where the infamous Dyatlov Pass incident took place.